Welcome back. This is part three in our side chaining videos from Recording School Online. If you haven't seen the first two, you need to follow the, prog the progression to get the most out of it. Okay, we've totally changed this now. We're still on the same tune, but we're going for a completely different thing now. This is very cool. It's used quite a bit in dance music, as you, you'll see why. I've, I've changed our synth to a tone generator, which just comes with Cubase. I still have the gate. And before I change it, have a listen. Once again, it's being triggered by the kick drum. What we're going to do is use it to add a really low, deep, punchy kick sound, or frequencies to the kick. Quick, easy. Once again, the way we set it up was exactly the same as the first effect. So if you haven't seen the first video, go back. And we're triggering this from the kick drum. All it is is a simple tone generator. We're turning it way down. Um, let's go over there. It's just a test signal tone generator. And we're adding frequency at about 70 hertz, very low, which is actually thickening up the kick. Very fat. Turn it off. Off. Very cool. It's a producer's trick you hear all the time on dance hits. Now let's take that further. What if we took a compressor or even some type of distortion? I mean, you can you could go so many different ways with this. Let's run it through a little distortion. Just a little. Nice for adding a little harmonic content to it. Now, another thing we could do is use our little friend here. Very fat. Those are the kind of sub-bass frequencies you hear on those car stereos going by at 100 miles an hour. Now, this can be adjusted to, to taste. In other words, the release time on the gate really will make a big difference. Let's bring it way down. Let's take it a step further than that. And let's just squash the sucker down.
Now, in reality, you don't really want to hear it. You want to feel it. So you want it just loud enough to add those low frequencies when reproduced on a system with a sub will really, really sound fat. Okay, now go to your next video.